Since the Senate last considered immigration reform in 2006 and 2007, we've made enormous strides on border security. And this bill takes even more steps to prevent and deter illegal immigration. Let's, you know, we can talk about philosophy and we can talk about things people have heard. I'd like to just talk about facts. Uh, they may be inconvenient to some who don't want to have immigration reform, but the facts speak for themselves. The Border Patrol has doubled in the past 10 years. It now has more than 21,000 agents. That's more than any time in its history. From the Obama administration, they have 21,000 agents, more than they've ever had under either Democratic or Republican administrations. The Department of Homeland Security has deployed additional technology and aircraft hundreds of miles of fencing along the southern border. And then we talk about illegal crossings. Here's a fact. Illegal border crossings are near 40 years lows under this administration because fewer people are trying to cross. In 2005, Border Patrol apprehended more than 1.1 million individuals who unlawfully crossed the border. 2012, that number is down to a third, roughly 365,000. And at the same time, deportations, we all know, are at record high levels. But here's one of the things we should talk about. People ignore the fact we spend more money on enforcing our immigration and custom laws than we do on all our other federal law enforcement agencies put together put together that for those who care about law enforcement that's kind of a striking number so we have done enforcement first but this legislation goes even further to build on what's been a successful record